Managing and deploying Docker containers can be done in many ways. You can use the straight up Docker command. You can work via one of the many GUI tools, both web-based and desktop client oriented, or you opt to go the Docker Compose route. What is Docker Compose? Simple. Docker Compose is used for the creation of containers and the links between them. However, the Docker Compose command is actually quite a bit more useful than that. With this command, you can build images, scale and heal containers, view output from containers, list the public port of a container, and much more. But how do you use Docker Compose? Let's find out how. In order to install Docker Compose, issue the following commands. sudo curl dash capital L, double quote HTTPS colon, forward slash forward slash github.com, forward slash docker, forward slash compose, forward slash releases, forward slash download, forward slash 1.23.1, forward slash docker dash compose dash dollar sign, open parentheses, uname, space, dash s, close parentheses, dash dollar sign, open parentheses, uname, space, dash m, close parentheses, double quote, dash o, forward slash user, forward slash local, forward slash bin, forward slash docker dash compose. sudo chmod plus x forward slash user forward slash local forward slash bin forward slash docker compose. To deploy a container with docker compose, you'd first have to create a docker dash compose dot yml file. Once you've crafted the file, build the project and deploy the container in detached mode with the command docker dash compose up dash d. Let's say you want to check the logs from your deployment. To do this, issue the command docker dash compose logs. If you want to view only the logs for the WordPress service, that command would be docker dash compose logs WordPress. You could also follow the output of the logs in the same manner you use the tail command like so. docker dash compose logs dash f WordPress. What if you forgot which LAN facing port you used in your deployment? Find out with the command docker dash compose port WordPress 80. And that should get you started with the power to be found in Docker Compose. When next we visit this topic, we'll break down the docker compose.yml file and find out how to build your own. Okay.